Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and I'm back with another tutorial video, of course. And it will be the cyberpunk, of course, you have seen in the thumbnails. And I know I have been modding Red Dead Redemption 2 or making video about Red Dead Redemption 2. But yeah, sometimes it will be different. Uh, sometimes I make difference. It's okay. So let's go. So guys, uh, before you install the mod, you need the essential modes to install any mod in the game. And you need to exit the any third party app that overlay the game, like MSI Afterburner or Driver Tuner, like that. Because it will conflict with the server engine tweaks. This is the main mod engine. And if you enable the third party app overlay it will conflict with them and the modes will not work like cyber engine tweaks will not work not showing like that so if you have any install any third party app please exit before opening the game you need another thing to do before installing any modes just install the pc radix x64 i'll give you all the file links in the description below so do need to worry you can just go to like let me show you uh like this is the code where uh, it almost every mode will be in Nexus mode. So just here, go to the link, every link, and go to here file, and you need to download manual download. Of course, again download. Of course, if you don't show the download button, then you need to sign up for free. If you haven't used any Nexus mode before and slow download, it will automatically download your desired file. Um, today I'm here to show you the exact version of this modding tool that you need to install in 2077 because you need those tools to install any mod into your game with and without any crashes so let me show you uh, which file you need uh, first of all my game version is the cyberpunk 2027 phantom liberty 2.12a and this is the latest version uh, till August 2024. And this is the game and mode list. Uh, 12 of them, including the game. And 11 and 12th number is the optional. So let me show you, this is the game. And again, Cyberpunk 2077 2.12a. And number one modding tools, the Cyber Engine Tweaks. You can download the file from the GitHub or the Nexus mode. As you wish, I'll give you all the link in the description below. But for this game version, this game, this mode version, modding tool version is must be needed. First one, the Cyber Engine Tweaks 1.32.3, then Codeware 1.12.4, then the Cyber CMD 0.0.12, then the Equipment X 1.2.3, Native Setting UI 1.96, and Red Forest 1.25.0, Ready Script 0.5.24. Tweak Excel 1.104 and the Archip Excel 1.16.6 and the input loader and the input loader fix this is the optional uh, so I don't recommend that you must have it but you should have it okay so now it's time to install the mode uh, so this is the game root folder if you don't know how to open the root folder of your games it doesn't matter I'm gonna show you let say if you're, if you're a stream user and if you have a legit copy of your game then open the stream and go to library and suppose this is the game I don't have the game in like in my stream just go to your library and go to your game and go to here manage and go to again manage and go to browse local files it will automatically open the root folder of your game so it's like that and you can open the root folder of your game if you have an epic launcher or the GOG launcher it's almost the same so so if you install these modes then you can install all of the modes mode history of cyberpunk 2077 okay so let's install the modes uh, I have opened the root folder of my game I already told you then here first of all we are going to 
install the cyber engine tweaks of course you don't know how to install them just open them you can see the bin folder and my cyber engine tweak version is 1.32.3 yeah this one uh, just drag and drop in the root folder of your game it will automatically copy the file in your bin folder so guys we have opened the game after installing only cyber engine tweaks you can already see that the insert menu the cyber engine tweaks menu is appeared but we don't have yet bind any keys so we need to bind the keys for the first time this is the unbound key and you can choose as your wish you can choose any key in your keyboard so i will select the insert key to open or close the menu here you can see this is the menu and if i click insert then yeah it's gone so yeah before installing any other modes we need to we need to see that 7 g tweaks is working or not so yeah let's install the other modes okay so now that we have installed the cyber engine tweaks and we have opened the game and we have tested because it is working properly now we are going to install the code web like that just drag and drop in the root directory of your game now we have installed code web now we are going to install the cyber cmd just select two of them and drag and drop in the root directory of your game it will automatically place in the right folder after that we need to install the equipment x again these two folder are six are cheap just drag and drop in the root directory of your game so here you can see that we have copied the file and we are going to install it later the native UI just open the red forex again drag and drop these two file in the root directory of your game so now we're going to install the right script again these two file r6 and engine drag and drop in the root directory of your game just close this one then and again the tweaks excel drag and drop in the root directory of your game the archive excel just drag and drop in the root directory of your game i have already installed it so that's why i'm not gonna copy it again uh, so we have installed all the essential modding to file and of course we're gonna test it that it is having an issue to open the game or not also we are going to install a mode that for test purpose let's see i have downloaded two modes i'm going to install one of them the no intro videos uh, of course those who have installing modes more and more and they want to test new modes they are frustrated of the intro video because it's take and time and consumes time so we are going to fix that uh, there's two files those who want to quickly load out the latest shape of your game you can use this one but before that going to install this main file just drag and drop the root directory of your game i'm not gonna install this one because it will automatically load the latest shapes but let's see uh, so let's open the game that we have any complication issue or something like that or it's just opening fine so let's open the game so guys now we have opened the game here you can see it, it is automatically skipped the intro because we have installed the mode uh, here let's open the cyber engine tricks clicking the insert and here all the modding tool is working just fine because if it isn't working working correctly then it will create a crash error or something like that and it will crash immediately but here and we have have an install we have installed only one mode uh, the freeze and freeze look at camera but until now it's working just fine so yeah that's it guys that's how 
you install all the essential modding tools for Cyberpunk 2077. And that's the video. So if you like the video, please like and subscribe my channel. And if you have any problem, please let me know in the comment section. I'll get to you as soon as possible. Or if you have any specific mode requests, also let me know in the comment section. I'll get to you as soon as possible. Until next video, goodbye. Thank you.